Coming up, Americans aren't the only ones who like to cool off with frozen foods. Trigo. Get the scoop on a frosty Italian dessert after this. Welcome back to Unwrapped, where we are going zero and below in our search for shivery snacks. Now, believe it or not, Americans eat an average of 48 pints of ice cream every year, and that's more than any other country. But I can't imagine that Italians aren't far behind, because let me tell you, they love their gelato. But what is the difference between gelato and ice cream? What do you say we travel to Texas? Texas? To find out. Mm, love my ice cream. Texas makes most people think of cattle and cowboys, not ice cream. But this couple from Italy is hoping to change all that with their chain of gelato stores called Pachugo. My dream when I came to the United States was to bring authentic Italian gelato here. And now we have 200 different recipes. Prego. What is gelato? Is it really ice cream? Gelato in Italian means ice cream. But gelato is lower in butterfat than traditional American ice cream, so it's more like a soft, frozen dessert. It starts with just milk and sugar. We use whole milk. We use uh, regular sugar. We don't use any high fructose corn syrup. A batch freezer churns the milk and sugar for about three minutes. And then I'm going to open the little door. And just like that, the gelato flows from the freezer, ready for toppings galore. Christiana designs exotic flavors like banana flambe, chocolate orange saffron, and Mediterranean sea salt caramel. Gelato might be new to America, but in Italy, it's centuries old. Today, there are more than 40 Pachugo stores across America. And the name, well, it means messy concoction. It's fun, you're enjoying it. That is a Pachugo. Mm, mm, mm. 